Yo, ha ha, Bill uh, episode. YouTube, your boy Mel Nevison coming back with another quick video. Today we got the Nike Kobe Mamba Halo hoodie, and quite frankly, your boy is ever so excited because this hoodie, although it came in kind of this small box, this hoodie, at least for the duration of this video, you're going to see probably a lot of black light into this because to the naked eye, when you're looking through the camera. You're not going to be able to see um, a bunch of the cows, at least designs that they put on the hoodie itself. I think it's best represented by the, the halo, at least the black light. You'll be able to see pretty much every and anything that's included on this hoodie. So I will try to make it as clear as possible. Of course, your boy actually did order a size 2XL. And let me explain real quick. I normally wear XL in hoodies, but because most Nike clothes aren't pre-shrunk, I don't want to run that risk that, you know, I put this in the washing machine, you know, put it on the dryer, then all of a sudden, you know, it starts to shrink. So to avoid that, at least to alleviate that, I usually go a size up. Um, typically, if you want to do something like this, I would re recommend at least drying it on tumble, at least low dry. You definitely do not want to put this on high dry. I can ultimately guarantee you it will shrink. And of course, I will get into the material details when I unbag this, which is actually now. So, without further ado, man, let's get this thing open because I heard a lot of good things about this hoodie. Uh, some people were saying that it looks like it's plain Jane. Ooh, this feels good. This definitely feels good. So, yeah, you're going to like this. So, you can see right here, of course, as I'm showing you this, it will be a video right here with the black light so you can see these designs. You got the Mamba. Kobe logo, at least on the front. Let me just pop this thing open real quick. So on the front, you got Kobe's logo right here. At least let me take this out. Uh, this feels really good. For anybody wondering, I know that this is 80% in terms of material. You're talking 80% cotton, 20% polyester. And that's why, you know, you got to watch that combination. But it does feel good. It does have a fleece-like material on the inside. I can actually feel that without even... You can see it right here. This this is fleece. So I want to say around fall, winter time would be the perfect time to kind of wear this. Um, this is definitely going to keep you warm. Of course, you do have on the back, and I think everybody's been seeing this, number eight for Kobe Bryant's jersey, number 24, which is the other number jersey that Kobe Bryant wore. Uh, in fact, I think on the sleeves, you'll also see a Nike logo at least on the left side, and then also on the right side, that's where I, I figured the signature would be. Of course, you see, hopefully you can see it, but I know you'll have a video right here, but it got the black Mamba logo representation. This is phenomenal. This is definitely phenomenal. I like this. The only thing is that, look, I will say handle with care. <laughs> you can see me modeling it right here. It does have... The kangaroo style pockets, and they're pretty deep. So, you know, if you want to rest your hands in there, especially during the fall time, during the winter time, your hands are kind of cold and you want to kind of rest them, that's definitely a good place. But this, in my opinion, is good. Now, in terms of the little string, or at least the <laughs> the straps, they're they're pretty much pretty much plain Jane. And I kind of figured out because of the whole pricing being, I think it was $70 for these. Typically, Nike steps the tech up. And they'll charge anywhere from 100 and up. But 70 I think they actually kept the materials to a bare minimum to a certain point. But that, again, that polyester uh, and cotton combination actually makes this for a very comfortable hoodie. Comment below. Let me know what you think of the Nike Kobe Mambo Halo hoodie. Of course, again, got that black light showing every little part, at least bit parts of this design. I guarantee you when you hit different lights or different light sources, at least outside, you'll be able to see the whole 824, the Mamba logo itself. Uh, I think this is kind of like a two-tone design, if that makes sense. This is all printed. And one thing I do like, if you can see that, they do have like that snakeskin representation. You got that Mamba mentality. Uh, I do like that little added touch that they put on here. Makes for a nice little hoodie. And I can't wait to sport this during the fall. 
and the winter time. But your boy Millipson, man, I am out. just want to show you that quick video because whew, your boy is a huge Mamba fan. And I actually, I'm glad I got it because, you know, I had the Mamba see this. This is going to go hand in hand. And I look forward to the fall and the winter. But your boy Millipson, man, I am out. And you guys, this is fantastic. Of course, I'm going to do it this way. Stay blessed.